yesterday. <sighs> Carly. Want something to eat? You get the apple. Have an apple, Carly. God, I used to eat an apple every morning with some granola and six almonds, and that wasn't enough even then. But you know what? Yes. All right. How many pieces of food are left now? Two. Jerky. I give you more food. <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, I guess. Can I? Can I keep a piece for myself? All right. Fuckerberg, Kenny. Want something to eat? Oh, he's getting my jerky. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Yes, he did. Uh, no. Come talk to me once my boy's taken God care of. God damn it. I'm not... <clears throat> there are two pieces of food left. He's just like, fuck this shit, man. I don't... Fucking duck, though. People are playing fucking games on Steam. Hold on. Shift tab that. How do I go offline? Okay, I don't know how to go offline. I digress. <sighs> hey, Doc. How about a little food? <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with his face? What is he doing? Fuck you, Doc. Hope you choke on it. Yeah! Oh, man, I'm so hungry! Fucking choke on that, you piece of shit. Alright, now all the people I care about... Oh, some of this oh fine. I guess I could share the jerky. And I love beef jerky. It's a Slim Jim. Love me them Slim Jims. Alright, fuck you. That guy is doing something. Where is the fucking guy who was with me in the beginning? What the fuck are you doing? You're like moonwalking here, Lee. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Uh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. And 60 cents could buy me a bag of chips. Maybe two if I'm lucky. Just for that, I'm going to give you some food, Mark. Take some food. Here, eat something. Eat the beef jerky. Thanks, Lee. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Oh my god, whatever. Here, this should help. Try not to make too much noise. Yeah, yeah, we're not stupid. Can I get my axe back? Come on, Larry. What is it between you two? Why do you have a personal grudge against Lee? He knows Because I'm trying to fuck his daughter. <laughs> uh, not every game is about fucking the female. Roll, Steven. Bruce. Whatever the fuck my name is. Not such an easy job, it's is it? It's actually pretty easy. Never said it was. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every here. day. I don't have a choice. Lee. Kitty, I know I ran out of food before. Hey, it was a tough choice. But you took care of the kids. That's what a real man does. <laughs> Thanks, Kitty. You the man. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. You're out! What happened to my food? There's none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are no For years, old timer. You want to talk, old man? Yeah. Well, I don't see you working on that wall. Let me put a bullet in the back of his head, please. Ken, Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it! I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing. I'm sick of this. Yeah, show I'm gonna too. storm out too. You don't think I am? Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's for the best. We're already struggling to feed our own kids. That man you brought, I tried, but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that kind of spooked me. Oh, I'm supposed to mash Q. I'm supposed to mash Q. E. Okay. What the fuck? This is Wolf Among Us all over again. Oh, no. What the fuck? You got to alternate right here. Say, oh, you thought I was going to alternate. Give me the fucking axe. You fucking missed. 
Lee, get the fuck out of the truck! Motherfucker! What the? Mm. Bitch, get the fuck off these is Louis Vuitton! I fucking smoke your ass! Get the fuck back! Get the motherfucker! Oh shit! I fell! I'm gonna pull your motherfucking eyes out, bitch! Don't shoot it! Just could have used the axe. What are you gonna do? Take the bullet out of its fucking head? You okay? Yeah. Thanks. God damn it. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Fuck you. Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all You almost killed. got me killed. Shouldn't have given you the fucking fire axe. Fucking ass. I gotta dispose of the You body. said he wasn't bitten. What? We asked you point blank, was he bitten, and you said no. He wasn't. Well, your not bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife. What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does uh, it. Oh, revelations. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's going to happen to all of us. We're all infected? Everyone? I, I guess so. I don't know. I, all I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym, and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning, and... God. Back off! Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we... We just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Carly. Are you armed? Yeah. F for protection. Dead could be anywhere. Makes sense, makes sense. But, uh, I think you got the upper hand here. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, hmm. we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Food. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'm going with Yay. you. Yay. I got your back if anything seems fishy. Thanks, Carly. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? You've got a deal. They got food. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Only on season Sounds three fair. of the TV Double show. Gallon should power one of our generators for a while. Yay! Loading screen. So this dairy, you guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. Sweet. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Just you. Well, I haven't told anyone. Clementine knows. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I couldn't lie to her. What exactly did happen with the Senator? It was an accident. I mean, I, I pretty much knew about the affair. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years, I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I uh, really appreciate that. Thanks, Carly. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like. Yeah, to I'm a Georgia you man. Seem pretty settled in at that motor in. Uh, who's running things over there? We work as a group. All of us looking out for each other. 
I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Good bet. Nine, including the kids. You forgot Ben. Me? That makes it ten. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. He looks like Charlie. I've been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's. You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. Get low, get low. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Cut your toes. Oh, Gary, you're always Fucking pulling this shit. Get low, it's get low. Those look like the people who oh, raided my camp. Who knows? Who are they? Shh. Fuck you. Fucking you knew we were hungry. They and you guys were keeping it there's all to yourself. There's only two of them. Oh, no. There's yeah, and you know what? More. We ate it all. What are you going to fucking do about it? Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out. And they don't we'll notice go. these, like, six people. Fuck oh, you. shit. Oh! Maybe he had stuff on him. I don't know. Just a thought. Here it is. St. John Family Dairy. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. Oh, cool, man. The fence keeps them out. You betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. Hey, <laughs> you best believe your sweet patootie it is a lot, Carly. Ever have any accidents? Nah. It's safer here than out there. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is ah. in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. Mama. I'm going to St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from oh, Macon. These biscuits. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. They grow them good there. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? We all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Now that y'all are here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Does that offer apply to the rest of us? We're all incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh mm, biscuits. Morning. Amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully, Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be what All we need is some Popeye's crispy chicken. Your cow is sick? What's she? We have a vet, but we could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered. Maybe our whole group could come for the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend, and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you or we hungry could souls. stay, like, the night forever. It'll be nice forever. to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Bye, Carly. Better not fucking touch her, Ben. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. All right. You betcha. Sure. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh, man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place oh, my fucking stay. headphones are so retarded.
Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously, they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. All right. I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. All right. All right, all right, all right. Okay, so I still have my fire axe, which is... I thought left shift was to sprint. Is that Andy? That's Andy. Hello. Look at that. Song. If a couple of tools out of the open is as unsafe as it gets, we'll be fine here. Would have been nice to have one of these back at the motor end. What the fuck are you doing, Lee? Look at that board. Oh. I bet they go through a lot of wood keeping those fences right You there. bet you did, do. Darn sure. Touch it. Fucking touch it, Lee. Don't be a fucking pussy. Looks like the fence runs around the entire property, not just the house. Touch it. Yep. Can't take any chances when it comes to safety. Mm -hmm. Alright, so I guess we'll talk to Andy. Andy, what do you got for us? Can I go walk the perimeter now? Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys <laughs> decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? We've scraped together a good supply in the last few months. How about yourselves? What kind of protection do you have around here? We collected a few guns to protect ourselves, but we really only use them when we go off the property. When we're inside the perimeter, the fence is all we need to keep us safe. Hmm. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big I think help. this is where I last played, enough. when I last stay recorded it. And Never know. Stopped. I'm gonna try and beat this all in one session. God damn it, activate Windows, are you serious? Because fucking, ever since I reset my PC, it's just been like fucking with me. Like, and it, it pretty much, like, fucked up the windows, like, um, the product key. So how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides oh, Lee. He wouldn't be such a pain in the ass Put if you weren't telling silent. him we were talking behind his back all the there time. There you go. I, I'm, I'm sorry, all right? That guy's a piece of shit anyway. Relax. You're not making things any better riling him up. Ew, it's pecking at it. There's one. Yeah, he's pecking at it. What the fuck? That is disgusting. Ugh. Give me a kiss. Lee, it's dead. Lee, 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 Arrow, you, you might need the arrow for something. You never know. All right, let's fucking Sparta kick his ass. Ah, uh, what a bitch! What a bitch! Come on, I'm sure there's still a. What a more. bitch! Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? The fortress needs people to defend it. We've got enough people. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. These folks are just delaying the inevitable. This place is gonna fall apart, just like everywhere else. <sighs> Maybe you're right. There's another one. I see it. What's she trying to do? Gimme kiss. Really? Ew. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. 
He's just everyday shit with me, yo. Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Thanks for the rations earlier. It's not easy eating in front of the kids, but it's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. I'm hungry too, Mark. Do you think they're gonna be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? If they've got as much food as they say, I, I think so. Come on. I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, 